Ooh, Leo, I'm going to feel so bad if I got the artist on this wrong. But, Riri popping up. Is it Rihanna? It's Rihanna. I think it's Rihanna. It's Rihanna. Call me rude, boy, boy, is you big enough? Call me rude, boy, boy, is you cute? Like, can you get it up, baby, baby? Take it, take it. Full moon Virgo reads. What are you working on? How are you being of service to others? And, um, you know, how's your health? In this full moon, Leo. Call me rude, boy, boy, is you big enough? Um, welcome to horoscope -ish. My name is Lindsay. <sighs> this is for entertainment purposes only. Do not take advice or counsel. Don't make any life altering decisions because we are throwing down some cards. Just getting some energy to see where we're at. Leo. Woo. Wow. <gasps> Girl. Not even tripping. Mm hmm. Okay. To everything, turn, turn, turn. You know what's an interesting feeling I just got? Like, uh, this, uh, call me rude, but are you big enough? Are you man enough to take this? Uh, Leo, I feel like you li literally have been like, wait a minute. Uh, rude? Like, you don't have to take this lion down. And lion, ah, you can't tell me this shit isn't fun. Okay, so. Call me rude boy, boy. Like, acting in your masculine, if anything. You may not be a boy, but, or a man. But, Rihanna got something to say to you, and it's almost like, and not, not, not Rihanna, not, not the artist. Um, sometimes, it's not about call me rude, but can you do this? Can can you withstand me, Leo? Leo's like, what? Um, like, can you stand me? All right, things are changing. Things are changing, and the challenge here is uh, family. There's something about seeing all the colors of the rainbow, um, and it's I don't I don't get a I don't get a, a homosexual vibe from this at all. Um, it's more like I see all the colors of emotion, you know, uh, like Phoebe, you know, like yeah, I see all the colors of emotion. So you're seeing all these emotions, right? And it's a challenge. You're like, it, like look at this cat. The ears are back and everything. <laughs> like what? Am I big enough? Yeah. Um, is there a reason why this is so pronounced when, you know, the other options here are... It's almost like this is the clean end and this is the end that, you know, you're not really interested in. Ugh, excuse me. You're looking at the change. There's five bowls there. One, two, three, four. Wait. One, two, three, four, five. There's six bowls. So you're looking at a much more promising uh, way to feel. Kind of like, um, please try and see things my way. Uh, because the somewhat symmetrical feel of... This has to match, like the aesthetic, the six. There's one, two, three. There, so the structure within a family is is so not the way Leo wants to look at it. But they kind of have to, being in the family. Um, the the what started all this was uh, um, somebody being worried, like having an anxiety. Um, it's like you know, you know how a cat goes to a tower or something or the cat tower and they uh, stretch out on it um, you know and kind of sharpen sharpen their nails or whatever um, that's both soothing and necessary for cats so um, it's kind of like you you gotta keep you gotta keep your uh, your your body right right you gotta keep your body right 
Um, you got to keep yourself in, in uh, your mental has to uh, speak to your, Leo, you are heart energy. Um, it is that confidence. It is that listen to your heart when it's calling. You got to take care of this. But you're like, can we look at it from a much more optimistic perspective, please? <laughs> please? No? Okay. I'm just going to go scratch my nails and be like, I... I'm going to need to get away from this somehow, and so these nails need to grip, you know what I'm saying? Um, necessarily to get up and out and away and over somewhere else. Um, so in the recent past, and this is a working thing, so you are literally working on your service to yourself. It's almost like bringing your, um, bringing your awareness, ooh, Leo, more to yourself and not to outside influence. Um, cause the outside influences are like, no, it looks like this. You don't even know. And Leo's like, <laughs> but what about this pretty set? <laughs> what about, what about this idea? Uh, what about this emotion? You know? So, um, in the recent past you, you're like, okay, I'm going to go with rigid grid. I'm going to go with what you think it is. Here's what I find very effing interesting about that Leo. They're looking at it like, why does it look the same? This is boring. Damn it. Do you do it like that? No. You just hope for the best. You get real close. You get real close. Like, oh, exactly. Like, you're presenting exactly what it is. It's almost boring. You're presenting what you're being asked to present, what you're being asked to go rigid grid with, what you're being asked to go societal with, and uh, it's still being picked through. It's still being scrutinized somehow. <laughs> so... I have very little patience for this for some reason. And I think it's on a demanding, entitled note. Outside of you is demanding and entitled. And I've been there, Leo. Woo! And it's not easy, but let me tell you how you do get through that. Um, sorry, I pulled the eight of uh, pentacles on the, the boring. It's not just boring. It's insatiable. It's insatiable. So honestly, what's on your mind right now is, and this is working on your health. This is this is service to self. Uh, Leo, you gotta be of more service to yourself. Um, mm. Because aren't you the bringer of positivity anyway with that, you know, your sister signs Aquarius. So, like, you know, all those hopes and those dreams, you know, uh, it, go to your big sister for advice. If anything, when the Aquarian read pops up on this, check that out. Because um, your, si your older sister's got something to say, uh, and it's not much. It's like, say less, say less, because there's a bigger picture. <clears throat> all right, Leo says. Okay, I, I, actually, Leo feels more like, okay, there's a bigger picture, especially if you're looking at the positivity. <laughs> like, yeah, 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 tell me what to do. Um, go for the Aquarian, the hopes, the dreams, the aspirations, the inspiration, the star. Um, look towards that person or place or thing, that noun, that really brings that part of you out, that, that, that colorful spectrum, because the blame mundane is kind of boring and a little insatiable. It's a lot insatiable, but things are changing. You're like, well, when will things change? When will things change? Um, what's on your mind right now is uh, it's kind of like you're keeping the rosy colored glasses. You don't want to see it. It's okay. You're, you know. Huh. Is this, is this rando? No. Is it going with the Knight of Cups? No. Is it going in the future position? Or is it going? Yep. Okay. <clears throat> cool. Near future. <laughs> Is that Leo? No. Someone's gonna be watching you. Um, kind of like beefing up a little bit too. This is this seems a little bit like it seems. What happens if I do this? Now remember, this is coming from a page's perspective. And pages can be children. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. But that's about it. 
uh, you, who does this not feel a bit karmic at the challenge? Look, both adult cat and baby cat have their ears back. <laughs> I feel like I've been in that situation before. Um, one is wrong -o. Not necessarily wrong -o. Obviously, the communication here, feelings are not being expressed correctly, meaning you got to meet people where they're at, including children. Um, so they're going to be all, oh. it doesn't have to happen like that. And maybe, okay, there's something about getting get your head, yep. Instead of looking for the answer in places where you think they are, like, you have higher knowledge about this, um, you can officially sit in the chair and be like, do you want to talk? Do you want to talk? We can move forward. We can face these demons. We can go into this dragon's lair. We can do it all. Do you want to sit and talk? Because I'm hiding what I'm hiding this I'm hiding this from you um I'm hiding these feelings from you uh because there's some kind of wisdom in that so if there's wisdom in that let's talk about that wisdom and sit down and have a chat so we can move on and it's causing a bit of a <gasps> How people are looking at you right now is, um, you know, you, you you offer plenty. There's so much here. This is like, uh, at least from what people have seen from you, Leo, it's it's more like um, there's a big cat and a little cat. So it's like. Because you have that chat, because you're having that chat, this this little one in the future is like, <gasps> well, people know that you provide more than enough for uh, for your roots, for for what came from you, the children. This is this is children, and um, you know they they know what you did, Leo. They know how you provided. They know that. Um, you're, you're, uh, you take care of children. They know that. Ooh. I like that that went with it. As a matter of fact, uh, your children kind of look up to you, too. Um. Ha ah, I just got this. They won't tell you that. Um. So. And never bring that up. Oh my gosh, never bring that up, Leo. Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Even in a good moment, don't do it. There's something, <laughs> there's something to that. Don't. Um, but uh, what you don't see coming is, I just uh, got empty nester. I got empty nester. So uh, you don't see an empty nest coming. Um, but look at how you and... I don't know. There's a, that. That seems like a very calm, collected situation to me. Three of Cups. It's kind of like uh, celebrating. You will be celebrating an empty nest. Uh, that's what you don't see coming. Uh, I want to get one more on that. <laughs> One person that you might be empty nesting with, maybe a little bit confused about what happened. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> like, there's a second party here looking up going, where did I go? And Leo's like, they gone. <laughs> then they gone. Um, all right, so you're divine. Uh, your, your, your divine guidance is to wait for a message. Wait for a message that things are karmically going around. Like, uh, where you were bit, Leo, um, they getting bit. And you're going to hear about it. So, um, well, you might not... You, you're going to hear... Somebody's going to tell you it's happening. Maybe even from... Um, I'm getting pedigree. 
like pure, pure. Someone with um. high social ranking, uh, just because of who they are, um, and it will cause a change, uh, but you don't really have to do much, but you can get curious if you want. You don't have to do much. You can invest your spirit. You can invest yourself again. The circumstances will be very different though, um, but it's nothing to be afraid of. It's more like, oh snap, that's different, right? So, um, yeah. And then the the outcome of this is you really do come out on top. There's like, um, and you kind of need to be there because you you're, you're 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 the glue, you're the glue, and this kind of glue you gotta hold it together. Otherwise, it does not function. It's so strange, um, uh, and it kind of has to, uh, especially if there's uh, things close to your heart, like uh, things that need to be taken care of, like uh, things outside of independent. Dependence. Dependence are involved. So, um, I just feel like there's a, a brand new opportunity to, uh, create a path that literally does not have time for crying over nothing. It doesn't have time for it. It does have time for it. It will not, this energy that you're going to be bringing forward does not have, it, I would, hmm. Whatever it is that you're really, really wanting, you're gonna get it. But you're gonna get it. You're gonna get it, period. Um, and that's, that's probably where we should wrap it up. I love you, Leo. Bye.